culture. To and both teams tonight unafraid to run offense through their bigs, Grant. Talk about the value of being able to do that. Yeah, B.A., you know, it just speaks to how both teams can beat you in multiple ways of playing. I think it can lead to... Substitution. Walker. Shooting for Phoenix. Devin Booker at the line for Wall. One of the most impressive things about Devin Booker has been his consistency. This guy is productive, and he is willing to carry the offensive burden. Doncic on the wing. Walker covering. No good on the triple. And you just can't afford to give up that kind of look very often. Inside. Here's Durant, and he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. So 2021 saw the addition of yet another honor to the resume of the great Kevin Durant, a selection to the NBA's 75th anniversary team. I don't think he needed cementing of his legacy, but it's just one more feather in his cap. Doncic with the bucket. The Suns have gotten 7 of 13 shots to drop. Walker passes to Durant. Oh, great D that time from Powell. Even with all those accomplishments, Durant is just as hungry as ever, Doris. The B.A., to me, he's always just in a competition against himself. He simply wants to play the best basketball night after night. Here's a guy who takes tremendous pride in being complete and perfecting his craft. And the jam by Walker. That'll be a move to remember. Wow. Yeah, great creativity in the air. And that was our AT&T 5G Slam Cam, bringing you the sauce. The Mavericks have gotten 8 of 16 attempts to fall. Outside, green. Doncic against Walker from 7. And Doncic with a nice bucket inside. Doncic has got 12 points in the game. Only one miss in his first six shots. He's definitely brought his A game. Walker finds Durant. And Durant with the big finish. Well, the remarkable timing of KD, sensing precisely when to cut in the pick and roll action. The Mavericks trailing. Doncic up top. Walker covering. And there's the call on Devin Booker. That's his first foul. McGee, he's checked in for the Mavericks. Craig is checked in for the Suns. Payne comes in for Devin Booker. Hook loose. Here's Powell. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. That one on Craig. This is a smart kid who works hard, right? I mean, Powell draws the foul, gets to the line. Nicely done, young man. Baisley, he's checked in for Phoenix. Lee comes in for Warren. Here's Walker. Doncic pulls down the board. That is a rarity. When he takes flight, he usually hammers it home. Outside, green. Ooh, plenty of contact on that shot. Officials call the foul, and he'll take two free throws now. And a moment here to take a look at the scoring breakdown for the Suns. They've been in rhythm from the in-between area. Just keeping things simple and taking what the D gives them. I think the other thing they've done a great job of is making their presence felt inside, converting tons of pain opportunities. Come on now, guys. That's flat out insane. Hey, when's the last time you saw a jam like that? They set the pick. Here's Hardaway. Again, the miss by the Mavericks. Phoenix has gone two for four from range to start things off. Pass to Lee. Green against Walker. Just five on the clock. Back to Lee. Let's the three fly. The shot comes out. So the Mavericks will take it the other way. They went to Phoenix for their last meeting with the Suns. Came out with a victory. They were really able to exploit that defense. I mean, getting almost any shot they wanted. It was that easy. Give them some credit. I'll tell you this. They caught an opponent on a very off night defensively. And you... Oh! Are you 
serious. That is some power from a point guard. Oh, I love backcourt players with some ups. We know versatility is huge in this game. Just a tremendous job finishing that play. Wow. Green for three. The putback. It's good on the putback. Just great positioning to get the rebound, then get it back up. The Suns leading. Outside Walker. Counted from distance. Walker's got nine. And that's what they want to do. Get him open looks early. Here's Green. Looking for his first basket still in this one. Outside Hardaway. To the inside. Oh, they pick off the pass. Walker against Green. The drive by Walker. And the jam by Walker. Adding insult to injury with the dunk off the steal. Nice to see a good play on D. That led to some fireworks. Uh, let's see if that serves as a momentum builder. What a great sequence for this group. Here's Doncic. Blanketed by the D. He fights to the rim for the layup. 14 points for him. What a finish by Luka Doncic. Don't underestimate his strength, but Don has got that in his game. Here's Walker. Pass to Baisley. Here's Payne. Up top, Walker. Shot clock at six. Back to Lee. Yes! Great play by Walker to set it up. <laughs> Their offense looking like a well-oiled machine. The Mavericks shooting 55%. An ideal start so far. There's 31 seconds left in the first. For three, Hardaway. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. Walker finds Payne. Back to Walker. Outside Payne. Pass to Walker. 13 feet out. Outside Payne. Over Powell. That went off the back iron and out. Boy, again, so little defensive pressure. You have to convert that. And so it's Phoenix with a six-point lead at the close of the quarter. Their key to consistency has been their dominance in the paint. They've been the more physical team. Time for a quick break. Hope you've enjoyed the broadcast so far. Halfway through the first half in this one. All right, guys, what stands out to you from the Suns in this one? They're getting a big contribution from the bench already. As a coach, I think you get a certain feel for what... And the Mavericks will go for a different look. Here, McGee, he's checked in for Wood. Powell comes in for Kleba. Hardaway's checked in for Bullock. And Luka Doncic subbed in for Irving. Durant, he's checked in for the Suns. Walker comes in for Payne. Green out there with Luka Doncic. Then it's Tim Hardaway. Then there's Dwight Powell. And it's McGee in at the center position. That's the lineup out there for the Mavericks. Green against Walker. Durant with a screen on Green. Walker passes to Durant. And the rebound goes to the Mavericks. Doncic has got four rebounds now. Hardaway with a screen on Walker. Pass to Hardaway. Walker against Doncic. The 15-footer. Again, the miss by the Mavericks. The Suns have gotten six of ten shots to drop in the second. Nice work. Durant with a screen on Green. Walker passes to Durant. And Durant with the big finish. Guys, so difficult to disrupt Kevin Durant's rhythm. The release point's so good. He can score from three levels. This guy is unstoppable. Doncic against Walker. For three, Hardaway. And the three-pointer goes. Hardaway's gotten himself going with a triple. His first basket of the game. Durant with a screen on Doncic. Walker passes to Durant. The kick out to Walker. And the jam by Walker. Now, I know he makes it look easy, but it takes incredible physical tools to pull that off. Athleticism and explosion. Dallas has gone three for seven from the perimeter during the second quarter. 
Doncic outside from deep three-point range. The Suns clear it. He has that confidence rolling, hitting two threes in the first, but he hasn't had one since. Screen by Durant. Walker passes to Durant, and it's good. Two points. Durant's got six points in the quarter. Well, it doesn't get any easier than that. Give Kevin Durant that interior look, and he will score it. Booker against Green. Pass to Doncic. And Doncic hammers it home. Just great offense. The screen freeing him up for the slam. Hey, without that screen, he doesn't get a clean look at the rim. Boy, that's a play you just practice time and time again, and that's the result of the work put in. Well, you know it takes courage to draw charges. Guys get trucked all the time, and they still call a blocking foul. You think more of those should be no calls, Grant? You know, B.A., courage is the right word. If you're willing to step in there and sacrifice your body for the sake of the team, you know what? If you don't give them a charge, I prefer the no call. I like that idea. Free throws good from Durant. What we are watching with Kevin Durant, guys, is simply greatness. This guy will go down as one of the greatest scorers the game has ever seen. Both shots good from the strike. And for Dallas, they're shooting only 36% during the second. Doncic passes to Hardaway. That one falls. Great setup by Doncic. Hardaway's got six. As the deep shots continue to fall, you can sense the frustration growing among these defenders. Duran with a screen on Hardaway. Walker with it. He's picked up by Hardaway. And it's slammed in by Durant. Uh, that's about positioning and length, and Kevin Durant gets up and is ready for the throwdown. Dallas has gotten only four of nine from beyond the arc here in the second. McGee a screen. Here's Hardaway. Oh, and a beautiful feed leads to a monster jam. I didn't know if they could match that last slam, but it only took them a couple of moments. Hey, not the best interior defense on those last few trips, but who cares? That was awesome. Sometimes a player is born with a passer's mindset. He deals it with conviction. Here's Doncic. That one doesn't drop. And Phoenix the other way now. And at home for the next one, it'll be Oklahoma City pulling in. And that's the first of just two home games for him. McGee with a steal. And a fast break now. The Mavericks on the run. On up the court. Here's Powell. Pass to McGee. Walker against Hardaway. Fires from deep. It's Powell on the wing. McGee with it. Defended by Craig. Goes up again. And it's laid in by McGee. McGee's gotten his second bucket. And once more this half, they find a way to get great position inside. Durant with a screen on Hardaway. Walker finds Durant, and he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. Well, the length and size of Kevin Durant make him a prime target on the interior. So good at forcing the issue close to the basket. I like how he's upped his aggressiveness here, finding ways to get to the line in this second quarter. And the Mavericks making a change here. Neil Aquinas checked in. Kyrie Irving's checked in for Nilakina. First team foul. Irving, the pass to Doncic. Irving, a screen on Payne. Here's Doncic. And Doncic hammers it home. Listen, this is becoming routine for Luka Doncic. This guy's a big-time scorer who can take over when he's ready. To the middle. Duran. All right, here's a look at the schedule for the Dallas Mavericks. On Tuesday, they'll be playing against Eric Bledsoe and the Utah Jazz. And then on Wednesday, they'll go up against C.J. McCollum and the New Orleans Pelicans. And that game against the Grizzlies, that's going to be a nice test for them. They'll get a chance to see just how they play against a team that most feel is better than them. Dallas shooting a solid 47%. Irving with it. And Walker picks him up defensively. And it's Irving missing. Boy, a really tough quarter for this guy. Just struggling to make shots right now. And the jam by Walker. You're not going to get stops against him unless you give an effort. And here is Irving. 
a reliable go-to guy for them. He's averaging around 26 and a half a game. Doncic on the wing. Clock at six. Oh, nice finish from the low block. That one's good. Doncic has got 20. Boy, at his size, Luka Doncic against a quality contest, able to still finish it. Walker with it. We saw him with 19 his last time out. Here's Durant. Doncic grabs the miss. Well, we didn't see the same kind of control we're used to seeing from him. This guy is usually a tremendous finisher. On the wing, Irving. Three-pointer. The Suns clear it. Lee's got his fourth rebound in this one. Second chance effort. They get the rebound. Pass to McGee. Now Doncic. Stolen by Payne. Here we go. One-on-one. -on -one. Here's Walker. And the jam by Walker. He almost brought the basket down on top of himself. Oh, there's hang time, and then there's a time to hang. And it's out of bounds. The Mavericks able to retain possession here. He clipped the ball there, but not enough to nab the steal. But a really good read on Kevin Durant has been leading the charge for the Phoenix Suns. He was dominant this quarter, scoring in bunches. We'll be right back with you shortly. The bench, a big reason they've got a sizable advantage. When you have guys coming in scoring points, it keeps your energy up. Sorry, guys, I can't add much. I never came off the bench. And now, as the season winds down, a look at the Western Conference picture. You know, for Phoenix, they've been phenomenal. All the lofty predictions, the expectations, they've all come true. Now comes the hardest part, the postseason. Every team is going to be gunning for them. That does it for halftime. Let's get back to game action. Here's Brian Anderson with the start of the third quarter. Big gap on the scoreboard. The second half begins with very different goals for these teams. One side trying to mount a comeback, one side trying to protect their lead. You know, Kevin Durant has really been making it happen here, guys. When he got good position and they got the ball to him, he was automatic. Well, you can see why they would continue to play through him. He was tough to stop, super assertive down low. Just great work. Kicking off the second half, here's Monty Williams' five. The deadly pair of Paul and Booker are the backcourt. DeAndre Ayton is out there with Kevin Durant, and it's Walker in at the three. Count that one. Wood's got 16 points now. And he's looking to get on a roll here to start the second half. And I've got to believe that was something they talked about during the break. Get him some good looks into the paint, get into the heart of the defense. Beautiful. And Booker with the jam. In that pick and roll Booker. set, option one, Booker taking it himself with good reason. Doncic against Paul. Pass to Wood. Shoots over Aiden. The bank shot, no good. Phoenix has gotten six of 11 threes to go in this game. Here's Durant. And Durant with the big finish. That's just perfect execution. Nice job hustling, and as a result, he gets rewarded with the bucket. You don't give the defense any chance to set up. Sometimes you just love an easy look. Irving, the pass to Wood. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. First one falls for him. T.J. Warren, he's checked in for the Suns. Christian Wood. Wood. And a closer look here at the scoring breakdown for Phoenix. Well, even halftime, they couldn't slow them down. They've been hitting from the mid-range, though, all game long. I also like how they've played in the painted area. They've made an effort to work on the inside and convert those chances. Here's Walker, and the jam by Walker. He's a living highlight reel. Seriously, that could end up being one of the best dunks of the year. And how about our AT&T 5G slam cam? Couldn't have captured that play any better. Good. And guys, this is why coaches value playing with pace. I think this is what we call, quote, running a team off the floor. They have been fantastic in transition. Offensive board. Kicks it to Doncic. 
Back to Hardaway. Puts up a three. Doesn't go that time. And Phoenix will come the other way. And Tim Hardaway Jr., a valuable offensive weapon, even if he's a bit of a volume shooter, Grant. Yeah, B.A., I mean, his efficiency has never been a selling point. But he consistently will fill up the box score and always willing to shoot and can create for himself. Just five to shoot. Walker's shot is off. Dallas has gone two for five from three since halftime. All right, let's check in with Allie LaForce. Well, guys, the NBA markets itself behind its star players, but Commissioner Adam Silver understands what makes the game tick. He said, quote, this is a team sport. In order to truly win championships and compete at the highest level, all the players have to come together. So true, Allie. Thank you. He's pouring it on at a nice clip, and the rest of the team is stepping up as well. And for Dallas, they're shooting just about 33% since this second half started. Payne against Doncic. Outside Hardaway. Takes the three. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. It's been an ugly quarter for him. Trying to shoot his way out of it. Might be time to work on the playmaking skills. Count that bucket. Walker's got six points in the quarter. And the defense has no one to blame but themselves. I mean, they just let him get right to the rim. To me, this has simply stated been a complete lack of defensive attention and focus all night long. Well, this guy flat out carrying the load for them offensively. He is taking and making good shots. What a terrific job. Doncic passes to Hardaway to halt the run. The shot is good. Doncic making the play. Doncic has got seven assists in the game. Well, Tim Hardaway Jr. getting stronger, and that's a problem when he's trying to finish through contact. Pass to Craig. There's the triple. Hits the trifecta. Craig's got himself going here. His first points of the game on the deep ball. He drops yet another dive, just facilitating this offense like a maestro. Now McGee. Five points in the game. Now here's Hardaway. Shoots over Walker. Deflected! Boy, blocking is a skill Darius base. Oh, oh, look at that! Oh, my oh, goodness! goodness. Good Cocked it back and fired at home! He's shaking the hoop. He's actually shaking the whole building. Oh, what a slam. Look here, the fans going crazy right now. Shoots off the step back, and he sinks that one, hitting the back of the rim on the way in. Hardaway's got 15 points. Guys, you want to be able to score from all three levels, and Hardaway Jr. is... Oh, oh, okay, then. Here in the second half, they've just found better shots. And I think what's happening is they're getting their shots within the flow of their offense, and you can clearly see the difference. Doncic passes to Hardaway. Another miss by Hardaway. He just keeps firing from distance. I know he's trying to heat up, but at what cost? Pass to Lee. Now here's Walker. And the foul is called. He missed it, so he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. It goes on Dwight Powell. And he drops it first. And the Mavericks going with a whole new group out there. Landale's checked in for the Suns. And both free throws good for Walker. So it's the Mavericks now. Here's Nelikina. Hey, we've heard a lot of coaches say. Here's Irving. Walker with a steal. Down low. It's Walker on the wing. And it's blocked by Irving. Don't tell me Kyrie Irving can't play defense. Send it back, Kai. For three, Booker misses there. So it's the Suns winning this one easily. Boy, this crowd has to be shocked by the way their team was dismantled. Now, shocked and surprised. It doesn't matter what the matchup is. You never expect a road team to just waltz in and cruise to the type of victory like we saw tonight.